we'll just go ahead and we'll split our media here and what I'm going to show you next is how to crossfade your media and you just grab the event that you would like to crossfade and you pull it into the other one and your crossfades will come in and what happens is is one piece of media will slowly fade out as the other piece of media fades in Okay, the audio will fade out, the audio will fade in. Now this might be a little difficult to, difficult to notice any change in the picture. So let me go back and grab uh, two pictures here from the import media. I'm going to go to my Y drive and my pictures. And we'll grab Freud and Gonzo. We'll open up these two. Put a little spot down here. So there's Sigmund Freud and there is um, Hunter S. Thompson. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these two and I'm going to fade automatic crossfade one into the other. And this one you'll be able to see how that works. Okay. Picture fades, one fades into the other. I can also do a manual fade just like this as I showed before and a manual fade here and then this picture will simply fade out to black and the other one will fade in okay so you can do either one okay so we're back to our automatic crossfade now now if you try to automatically crossfade and it does not work then you need to go up and select your automatic crossfade button on your toolbar and it kind of looks like a little origami paper cup and once that has been selected and you'll see nothing's happening here and I click on my automatic crossfades and they are back which is a handy little item to have 